Hi guys, John V here again from Phone Arena. You're watching our video review of Cobra's eye radar. You can tell from the packaging, it's a radar, laser, and camera detector. Here's the unit itself. It's available right now through a variety of different retailers for $130 on the average. Uh, it's touted as being the world's smartest and most advanced radar detecting system out there. And it gives you alert for things such as uh, other radar security systems and even things like red light cameras. And when it's combined with the iPhone 4, it gives you a little bit more functionality than your traditional radar detector. Now the odd radar doesn't deviate from the design of other radar detectors out there and it's pretty minimalistic with its approach. It's constructed out of this piano black glossy plastic which does attract a lot of fingerprints but it's not a, too much of a concern just because it's going to be placed primarily at your windshield and it's very lightweight and feels a little bit on the hollow side but again pretty nice overall. It just has uh, some nice curves to it but nothing out of the ordinary. On the left side we find the volume rocker which also acts as the dedicated powers toggle here so it's off right now you hear a click and it's turned on afterwards and you have also the power jack as well. As you can probably tell there's only one physical button on the eye radar and it's this large mute button right on the top which you press down to silence the uh, speaker when it's making some noise and on top here is the speaker grill. We can't see it now, but right here in the front edge, uh, built into the edge, is just one single LED. It turns either red or blue. Blue indicating that it's connected to the iPhone via Bluetooth, and red it's not. It doesn't do anything else aside from letting you know that it's on. And finally, in the back side, this is area here is completely flush. It's the place where you put it directly up to your windshield. The uh, slot right here is used with the suction. You just basically put it on. It allows you to attach it to your windshield without any problems. So now we'll quickly show you the iRadar application that's available for free through the App Store. It combines with the actual iRadar system here to give you a little bit more functionality than your typical uh, radar detector out there and utilizes the iPhone's uh, GPS to store data um, uh, as to what alerts are coming in. Now it's not connected just because it only comes packaged with the car charger. There's no wall charger, but we'll quickly show you it here. So here's the main interface. You have these icons here to get to the store settings, view map, and dashboard. Just quickly show you the settings here. You can disable some stuff, uh, turn on other things. Alert settings too, uh, whether or not you want it to alert for specific bands or not. And some other uh, GPS settings as well for you. But the main thing here is just the dashboard which provides all the pertinent information for the uh, for the iRadar system here. Now the main thing here you can tell it shows you how fast you're going so at any time you can always look at it and see exactly how fast you're going. Car battery voltage, how much charge the iRadar is getting with your car battery. And also the direction that you're moving, which is uh, pretty nice. Again, just more like a compass here. Um, and the nice thing about it is that you have also the toggle here for city and highway. So most of the stuff, is, or most of the functionality is done directly with the application. And there's very minimal interaction with the actual uh, device itself. Additionally, the other neat thing about it is, is the view map option, which we're going to quickly show you here. Now, what it does is that it shows you all the places you've been, and it actually marks down on the map uh, whether something is uh, a false alarm or something that's, uh, you know, something that's real, whether it be a police car or, or something else. Now, as you're driving, you'll hear the audio alert, which is nice. At the same time, it's going to pop up on the screen a different menu here, which shows you the type of band it is, whether it's a, it's a you know, X band, a KA band, or a K-band, whatever radar detection it's, uh, it's finding, and it marks it on the map here so it remembers it. So if you go back there and you know it's a false alarm just because it's a stores radar detection system that's being, you know, alerted, then it's not going to pop up again. You have the option of, you know, saying it's a real or false alarm. And the other neat thing is just that it also combines other things like speed traps and red light cameras, so you'll get notified from those things as well. So you know ahead of time what they're going to get yourself into. Overall, we're very satisfied with the iRadar, and when you look at it, it's just a standalone radar detector, and you don't think about the iPhone connected, it works well too, just because uh, you do get a lot of audio alerts with its speaker. Obviously, if, uh, uh, if an alert is getting close by, it's going to give you, the sound's going to be vigorous, so you know how close it is, and on top of that, uh, it does mention what kind of uh, band it is, whether it be an X band, a K band, a KA band, it'll notify you of that, and in our testing, it's been pretty accurate for the most part but of course when you combine it with the iPhone uh, it's connected with the application it just unlocks a lot more location-based services we 
you like the fact that it remembers uh, previous alerts so it doesn't come up again and on top of that you, you are given some additional things such as uh, speed traps and even red light cameras so you know ahead of time where you where you're driving and what to watch out for so it's pretty neat in that aspect a lot of functionality and hopefully we'll see a little bit more down the road but for $130 it's a pretty good deal if you could find it for anything less it's easily a bargain just because uh, you could find you know high-end radar detectors priced over at $200 so overall we're very happy with it so if you'd like to learn more about the iRadar you can check out our website phonearena.com thanks for watching guys